Hey guys, thanks for coming back to my channel. So as you can see in the title, this is going to be my updated skincare routine video. This was requested a lot by you guys, so I thought that I'd go ahead and do it. And I've been doing a lot of reviews lately, so I'm trying to think of other videos that I can do. Um, if you guys don't like my reviews, I do apologize. I am going to slow down very soon. And if you guys recognize the sweater and the big hair, is because I just got done filming my hair extensions video. So you can go ahead and check that out if you guys are interested in these bad boys. And the first thing I'm going to the first thing I'm going to start off with is my Neutrogena Neutrogena oil-free acne wash daily scrub. And this is basically um, a scrub with salicylic acid. And it said that it, it does say that it is an acne treatment, but it says that it helps breakouts before they start. So to be honest, my skin. Um, it's not really acne prone. I really don't get pimples or anything like that. So I've been using this for about five or six years to prevent pimples and it really, really does help. This is about $7.50 or $8 at drugstores and I really, really love it. Um, I talked about this in my collab channel with my sister over at Beauty Bargains and I've also talked about this in my other skincare routine video from last year. My cat is going nuts so please don't pay attention to her. So I really, really love this. Um, it's just a good cleanser just to kind of, um, just get off any impurities on your skin, removing makeup, dirt, oil, etc. There um, is like these little beads in there to kind of exfoliate, but it doesn't hurt your skin or anything like that. So I love that. Um, also, I after I use that, I go ahead and use my Sea Breeze. This is for sensitive skin. It's basically an astergent. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. And it deep cleans and it says tingly, refreshing feeling. So basically. I use this in the shower or in the morning, and after I'm done, I will use this just to get off any extra dirt or oil. I even showed this in my last skincare routine video, skincare routine video last year, and you guys will be amazed after you're done washing your face, you think it's clean, it's not. Use this, you can even get the one for non-sensitive skin, and you'll see extra dirt and extra like foundation and gross stuff coming off of your skin. So I love this, and this is about anywhere from two to four dollars at drugstores. So I love that. And then I use as of like moisturizer. This is my daytime. Ooh, this is my daytime moisturizer. This is by Will, um, Willita. I think I'm saying that right. And this is a Wild Rose moisturizing cream. It says for intense um, nourishment. It says uh, boo, 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 just the direction. So I guess it's made out of Wild Rose. I really, really love it. Um, the thing that actually made me pick this up was because in my Bridge box that I just got, I got the little sample, and then I went to um, CVS near my sister's house, and I've actually seen these, the bigger ones. So they sent me like an itty bitty sample, and I absolutely loved them. So this is what um, I purchased, and these were like $13. Um, I'll go ahead and show you guys the consistency. It's just a really, really good moisturizer to put on um, like under your foundation. It has a yellow tint. Kind of smells like rose but it doesn't smell perfumey um it gives you a nice sheen to your skin um and it smells really 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 good and crisp and clear so i love that that's my like daily moisturizer and as for eye cream or anything like that this is my cvs brand this is my eye lifting serum um you can pick this up it's like 12 to 14 dollars and it's actually a knockoff of the oil a one i'm not exactly sure but i'll go ahead and post um information below it has the same exact ingredients just for way 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 cheaper so i love this because i have under eye wrinkles and that's basically this is what i use on a daily basis my neutrogena face wash my sea breeze my moisturizer my eye cream now this is what i do at night um i'll do that in the morning put makeup on come home at night and i'll be super super tired um, this is not every single night, but this is honestly mostly every night. Um, I use my Neutrogena um, makeup removing towelettes. You get 25 in here. Um, and these are, it says basically dissolves all traces of makeup, even waterproof mascara. So I love these, and I found that these are the best ones. I really, really like the Yes to Cucumbers ones, and um, I do not like the Garnier Fautis ones. I think that these are the best. They actually moisturize your skin. It feels like you just washed your face. Um, usually one towel, one towelette does it for all of my makeup, and you guys know I wear tons of makeup. So I love this, so I would use one of these, take off all of my makeup off of my skin, use my sea breeze, and then I would put this on my skin, and this is our, these last two items are just samples, um, but they lasted me a really, really long time, and I'm going to get more. This is the Estee Lauder um, Advanced Night Repair Serum. 
Um, basically what it does, it kind of like, it's basically for like wrinkles and stuff like that. And um, you're not going to be able to tell, but it's like a goldish color um, serum and you just put it on your face. It's going to hydrate your skin, it's going to moisturize before your moisturizer. If that makes sense. And this is more for older girls. So if you guys are younger, you guys don't need this because I'm almost 25 and I have under eye circles. And then this is my night cream. This is my Estee Lauder Time Zone Line and Wrinkle Reducing Cream. Um, it does have SPF, of, uh, SPF 15. It says apply AM or PM um, after your repair serum. So you have to put this on and then this after. And this basically is for um, line and wrinkle. Line and wrinkles. Um, so the consistency of this is pretty thick. I will show you guys that. I'm not going to rub it into my skin because I'm rubbing out and I, I'm, <laughs> I'm running out and that's what it looks like. So I don't want to rub it into my skin because I'm running out. So that's what that looks like. I love the little packaging and when I run out of these two, I am going to purchase it. But if you guys are younger, like 14, 15, I don't really recommend this for you. If you guys are like 18 or 19 or 20, um, try it out. Um, but honestly, I think it's good to start preventing wrinkles when you're really, really young. But these may be a little too drastic and probably expensive because these are just testers. And I have no idea how much are the full size of these, but I'm sure Estee Lauder um, is expensive. So yeah, I don't even know how much they are. But I've just been using it for like a few months now, so I'm probably going to have to get it because I'm so used to it. But I hope they're not too expensive. So basically that's really about it. I know that this is a quick video, just pushing seven minutes. Um, it's a record for me. Um, I know I haven't been uploading videos really that much, but my next video is going to be a obsessive compulsive cosmetics um, lip balm, like lip tar um, review, so stay tuned for that, and I will see you guys in the next video. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Bye!